Yeah, that might be my new favorite thing ever. Handmade, hand chiseled ice. Pretty impressive, right? They were named one of the top 10 bars in Italy last year in 2019. The mango bubbles just kind of burst. Hey travel lovers, welcome to A Wanderlust for Life on YouTube, the channel that shows you European gems through food and memorable experiences. And today we are going to take you on a cocktail bar tour of Catania, Italy on the island of Sicily. I cannot wait to take you along. So let's get sipping. Oh, before we get into it, don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss any of our videos. And speaking of our videos, if you missed the last Catania video, I will leave the link down below. It is full of all the foods you should try while you are here. But for now, our first stop is at our favorite bar ever. It's called Bohem, and it is this tiny little... Well, it's a cocktail bar, but basically you tell them what you're feeling, what kind of flavors you like, or they'll ask you a bunch of questions to figure it out, and then they'll make a bespoke cocktail like this one. So I said I liked fruity vodka or gin, and kind of sweet. So this is watermelon and gin. That's about all I know about it, so I'm gonna give it a sip. Oh, wow. That is so good. So it is very watermelony. The gin, there's some herbs in there. I can't quite place it all, but it's just like, it makes your mouth salivate. Do you know what I'm talking about? It's super refreshing and it's really hot. So it's like 28 degrees, I think, probably 80s. And this is absolutely perfect. So this is a bar number one, and we're gonna take you to the second one. Number two of our favorite cocktail bars here in Catania is Circus. So this is up a hill, you have to work for it. But they were named one of the top 10 bars in Italy last year in 2019. I have the, I'm gonna cheat, Miso Embriacato. Probably saying that totally wrong. Apparently it has something to do with an Italian song. Um, but it's a gin cocktail. I'm gonna give it a try. Mm. It's really complex. So many different flavors going on in there. Again, it's making my mouth salivate. Maybe I'm just craving cocktails. <laughs> it's really, really good. But the creativity here, if you come here, the thing is you're gonna get a cocktail that is just super creative. That, that's the general idea. It's a circus theme, um, themed around like the late 19th century. So it's super fun inside, outside super cozy when it's nice and warm. And we have some oysters here that have lots of goodies on the inside. So yeah, lots of bar snacks for you to have too. All right, these are pretty big oysters. There's like sphere fights. <laughs> Is that the right word? Mango. Mango and I think a, a liqueur of some kind as well. Mm. The mango bubbles just kind of burst. If you've ever had boba tea or anything like that, um, with the like fruit bubbles it just kind of burst in your mouth that was really cool like the it was very like very sea watery plus the oyster plus that plus the I think it was bourbon oh that was good I love flavor combinations that create something entirely new <laughs> Obviously we are not doing all of the cocktail bars on one night. That's a little excessive even for us. <laughs> so now it's the next day. We are here in the San Barillo district and we are at the bar first. And we have this massive plate of food and two cocktails. This is a super cool hip area, but it's known for being like super tolerant. They want everybody to feel welcome. And there's a huge history to this place. So you just have to come. There's a full story on the front page. I got an apple mule, so it's basically a Moscow mule, but with apple and cinnamon, which is right up my alley. Yeah, that might be my new favorite thing ever. 
have I never heard of this? Anyway, this is our stop number three, and we have two more to go before the night ends, so join us because I have no idea how the rest of the night's gonna go. Cheers. <laughs> Our fourth stop is a favorite of ours. We came here in March and I couldn't wait to share it with you. This is Olivia.co and it's down this cute little alleyway. It's ridiculous and the owners are like the nicest people. And you, you can order like a regular drink, like a traditional drink, or you can kind of tell them what you're feeling, what you like, and then they'll create something for you. So I have a super cold drink. Um, I think it's uh, vodka and orange and cinnamon. That's about all I know. <laughs> so I'm gonna give it a try. I think the last time I was here, they also made me something, but like they literally treat you like family, which is one of the reasons I love it here. But the cocktails are good too. It does the thingy with the cheeks when it just kind of like it feels like it sucks the moisture out but at the same time it doesn't dry your mouth out I don't even know how to um, explain it better than that but it's super orangey but it's spiced so think um, like holiday flavors and it's just it's so wonderful and I love the creativity they have here it's just comfortable like this is I think if we lived here we would come here all the time and just hang like, I love all the cocktail bars that we're showing you, but this is just the place that you just want to, I think they have couches inside, if I remember correctly, just chill with your friends. And it's just absolutely amazing. I know this video is going kind of fast, but we thought we'd just show you all the places you need to go. And don't worry, there's one more left, and we're gonna enjoy our wonderful handmade cocktails with handmade, hand-chiseled ice. Pretty impressive, right? All right, on to the next one. Our final bar is the Collage Boutique Bar right off the main strip with its super creative drinks and it is so popular and we couldn't use the mic because it was so noisy, but the drinks were epically good and they also have an extensive food menu if you're feeling a little extra hungry in the evening. And it is a great place to finalize your time in the city. So sorry for the voiceover at the last bar. It was super loud and so was the music. Anyway, those are five amazing cocktail bars to try while you were here in Catania, Sicily. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you are interested in figuring out which foods to try, I will leave the video right next to my head so you can watch that video next. But enjoy your trip. It'll be amazing, I promise. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, give it a like and we'll see you in the next video. Bye guys.